My name is Olivia Joyce. I'm 18. I'm from Armadale. I was born and raised here and I currently go to New England Girls School. My first kind of interactions with the university were as a little girl, sport UNE, I would always be out there um, involved in netball and stuff like that. Um, but I guess more recently and away from the sport, my first kind of interactions were when I was in year eight, I think, and I came out and I did a camp with the Arala Centre. And so I just, that was kind of the first time that I became familiar with, um, you know, the campus and what, what is on offer out there. I'm currently doing geography, business, PDH, so I think that I will look to study something maybe in geography, which like I was always going to do something that was um, sport or something like that, but I just think that, you know, I tried something a little bit different going into year 11 and 12 and I really loved it, so I'll probably look to do something like planning or urban design or something like that. You know, the university is a space that I'm comfortable in now, like it's not this big daunting, you know, place on the hill that I have no, um, you know, connection to or it's foreign to me. I think that my eyes have been opened up to how many opportunities are out there for me. It's not just like this one little thing, oh, you can go and you can be a PE teacher or whatever, you can be a teacher because your mum was a teacher or anything like that. It's just um, been really beneficial in showing me what I do like and then you know, a bit further than that is what I don't like, things that I don't want to do, things that I thought I would love and I actually went out there, had a little taste and didn't enjoy as much. I can't even begin to explain how Arala has helped me as a person. Um, first of all, as a young girl, like year seven, maybe even year eight, I was never going to go to university. I was never going to, you know, I, you know, it's not like people around me hadn't been to university. It's not like it was something that um, seemed so far out of reach for me. It's just something that I didn't think I was interested in and I kind of had just set, shut it off in my brain, like I was not doing it. Um, but I think that the amount of time that I spend out at the Arala Centre and, um, you know, with the experience days and the camps and all of those things, I, I just feel so comfortable out there and um, comfortable enough that I'm, you know, ready to and I'm in a stage in my life where I'm beginning to explore what I will be doing, you know, post school. School's not going to last forever. Um, so I just think that it's been, you know, integral in helping me um, make some of the big decisions that are coming up or giving me information to make informed decisions about, you know, my future and what I want to do. I think that it's been, um, you know, really, I don't know, next level in giving me confidence in myself. Like um, out at the Arala Centre, I was given like an opportunity to be a leader and to, you know, excel at things that I was good at and, you know, test the limits with things that I probably wasn't as good at. So I just think that that has given me confidence in like all aspects of my life and allowed me to, you know, challenge myself a bit more than I would have. In year 11 at school I had to do a business plan um, and at the time I had really long thick hair and I couldn't keep my hair up in a bun when I played netball. Um, so I just, I, my business plan was around athletic scrunchies that allowed you to keep your hair up out of your face while you were doing practical things because I just found that nothing really worked for me. Um, and you know I did really well in that assessment and from there I was referred to the um, Smart Regional Incubator out at the university for their um, Emerge Young Entrepreneurs program. Honestly, without the camps and without um, the exposure that I've had to the university and the business centre and all of the places out there, I probably wouldn't have done it. I, I'm a quite um, anxious person by like trait. I'm just naturally anxious. So I think that um, if I hadn't have been out at the university and I hadn't have had the involvement with the Arala Centre that I did, I probably wouldn't have put myself out there, wouldn't have applied to do something like that. Then with the Emerge program, that was six weeks of intensive stuff. So every Thursday and Friday. So that just helped me further develop like the little business plan that I had to do for my year 11 assessment into, um, you know, a real business plan and, um, you know, help me with all of the things that you need to know that you don't really think that you need to know, you know, <laughs> when you do start a business. So we launched Running Bun Active off the back of that and, you know, currently it's on hold or I'm in year 12 so I, you know, prioritised some other things for a little bit but I think that um, that program was essential in opening my eyes to, um, you know, other opportunities that are at the university that aren't just study, like, yeah.